Both of you guys take six cards. Six is the uh, maximum that you're at for today for each of you because there's only two players. Fuck's sake. Oh, you don't have to take six cards if you don't want to. <laughs> All right, well, um, it's been a, it's been a um, good time, but the magic stick of heaven growing is no more. Okay. The magic item goes bye-bye. It, it it was just oh, a weird thing. Anyway. Is it magical technically or? I uh, actually no, that's a tech item. Oh, uh, great. Okay. One uh, torque else, goes away. Bing. One fork. Torque. Ice torque. Oh, good. <laughs> oh yeah, technically I do have those, even though I don't wear them. So. <laughs> uh, well. <laughs> Have you seen how many is in the uh, shared storage currently? No, and then multiply the hand. Holy shit! You know what would be really funny is if, if if Freddie did actually put them all on, and he ended up having you know like those <laughs> African ladies with shit that have the fucking the long necks with the, yes. the, the bracelets on. You could be like that with the talks, mate. <laughs> wow! You can imagine. One hundred twenty-nine. What the fuck? If it, you can imagine if it multiplied the abilities for everyone you had on. <laughs> That would be pretty sexy. Um, right. You so, Morgan, I have twelve bumps. Of <laughs> <laughs> I am Ice Demon. Right. You guys are starting off in. Uh, you know that you're in Kinleyville. Uh, you're sitting around the PC house outside. Right. You. I got to play. Uh, right. Oh, anti greed. But you play immediately. Oh, anti greed. Okay. You got any greed uh, cards? Anti -greed. Not anti greed. Nope. It's, cool. it's, in England, we say it like English people do. Right. <laughs> anyway, uh, you guys are sitting around in uh, Kinleyville. Uh, you, you're, the house is very nice. You can hear guards outside guarding it, or guards. And um, oh, okay. uh, yeah, you, they've got they've got actual guards on the house now due to uh, repeated break-ins, apparently. What? Mm. Yeah. How's the celebrations going? Uh, uh, the week long celebrations I proclaimed. Oh, oh, those those are already done because what? yeah, the PC spent a week uh, painting somewhere. It's been a long time, yeah. <laughs> it's been at least oh, yeah. three months or something since you played. Uh, yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. Uh, the <laughs> PCs are like, let's go paint for a, you know a year until I can get a fucking check in this. Mm. All right. So on the talks. Still there. Like all of them are still okay. Um They're actually right, flowing Alex. out of the storage chest and stuff. Oh, like Alex, the storage um, chest lid is kind of up a bit with torques spilling out. I don't know what you I don't know what kind of news you know about and what's been going on. No, but, no. Um, I mean there's things that need doing. Okay. You were outside. Mm. I, cool. I listen. Give me listen rolls. Don't worry, we know that you never learn to read at all. <laughs> uh, you you guys heard. I think Alex Kinley's in there. Quick, go get Darius and let him know. No, I, I'm not here. <laughs> you hear somebody running off. I pull out like Trump of the embassy. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, <sorry. laughs> he shows his card right. You guys disappear. He comes back with Darius and a bunch of other guys like burst in. Alex, we no, it's down. <laughs> 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 right, you guys managed to escape the uh, various plots and such there. Oh, my God, Trump's so good. <laughs> I mean, it took two minutes. By the way, just keep that in mind. Yeah, 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 yeah. Going, Come on, baby. Come on. <laughs> Got to get there. But, oh, yeah. <laughs> and then we'll get to this place and it's going to be like, hey, is that Freddy we here? Fucking get the other Trump out. <laughs> So you guys are in the uh, embassy and such. Uh, you, uh, you're sitting there. All right. So um, 
Well, I was going to try and do something with those tools, but... The door bursts open. Rhino Haggard looks at both of you carefully. He goes, you're not Joshua. No, he's busy. Oh, good. He closed the door. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> just, All right, so... Uh, just in case. Yeah, you hear him wandering off. He's not in a hurry, though. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just imagine kids, all all the kids labeled plots, uh, hanging off Kenley's legs and him kicking them off. The funny thing is, is like how many MMOs or games you know where where the PCs actually run away from the plot givers. <laughs> Most times they're like, "Where are the plot givers? Where are my quests? I want to come on, I want to build ten fucking turnips." And then we were like, "No, we're fucking the plot givers are coming. Use your scapegoats." <laughs> yeah. Oh, love it. Oh, well, it, it, it is underlining the value and importance of having a good Trump deck. Yes. Indeed. Do you have All a good right, Trump deck, Kinley? I'm getting it. Okay. Um, I know Freddie. Freddie's got one of the better. I think his is only second to Doc have, Bolton's. As far as our areas, I've got uh, the Royal House of Amber, White Dove, and Kinley Bill. I do not have the embassy. <laughs> we could have a paint <laughs> Uh, you you don't do you have uh, inside the firewall outside the firewall yes, also? I have inside firewall. I, I was there with the three of them when we did the whole thing, so I can get straight to the house, the amber house. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. All right. So um. So it's about the amber house guards running up. <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> <clears throat> Alex, um, do you Our know character. that there's a new pattern around? No. Okay, well, uh, to put a long story short, the <laughs> Red Gem of Judgment went bye-bye. Doc and Joshua and Razlan found it, or just Doc. Joshua died trying to recreate the pattern. Then Doc did some shit. Joshua came back. He's now in Obed's body. And then Doc that? made the new... Obed? He's, um... The weird guy from Kindleville. The Gimp. Ah, yes, of course. I, just, I knew yeah. the name, but I couldn't picture it. Oh, God, he's in that body? <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah. So, uh, this is still alive. So. He must have fumbled his just... Um. <laughs> so then, um, yeah, so then Doc made a new pattern to stop everything from go into shit basically because well things were changing clem was acting weird winter was coming all sorts of crazy shit was happening but it seems to be okay now give me pattern lore rolls or shadow sorry shadow lore rolls shadow the shadow Man, we've got way too many words right mm -hmm. Oh no, hold on. Shit, I'm looking at the bloody um, monster list. Oh, oh. <laughs> Just rolling the monsters, they show up. Rah! He's like, damn it, wrong thing. Uh, uh, <laughs> Yeah, you're thinking. Yeah, that's that. Probably it's probably because uh, uh, McKay is using Obed's body that all this happened. Yeah, I'm not surprised he's a freak. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Uh, Sorry. Anyway, there's, um, there's a new pattern now that Doc made, and no one's walked it yet. <sighs> and I just wanted to let you know in case. You wanted to walk it, you will get possibly, well, probably new abilities and other stuff like that. So, mm -hmm. just letting you know if you want to. I don't know what the, like, the trial will be. I don't know if it will be the same as the other pattern in Amber or if it will require you to have different sort of, you know, skills or abilities. But just letting you know if you want to 
Try it. I can take you there. It's up to you. <clears throat> dun, 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 so where, where actually is it? It's in a um. It's near the wall of fire. There's a little saloon called the Last Chance Saloon. Uh, you go there from Clems, so you'll need to be there first before you can use Clems. Yeah. So I can take you there if you want. And then um, you basically there's a wall. You put your hand to the wall, and you get teleported inside of I believe Ghost Wheel. If I'm not mistaken. Hmm. And the pattern is in there. Sorry. There's also a um this weird hand scanning device or something. Basically you put your hand on it, it scans you for some reason, and then it will probably ask you to walk the pattern. But you don't have to. I don't really know what it's for, but some <clears throat> weird AI shit. Weird AI shit? Yeah. Hmm. Some kind of computer thing. Way beyond my comprehension. Hmm. I didn't mess with it. So what, the, was, the, you know, the new pattern is connected to some some kind of AI? I mean, ghost wheel, I, I don't know if ghost wheel is some kind of an AI or what, but I know that this computer thing, from what Joshua told me, is some kind of really advanced AI machine thing. Demons, yes. Yeah, but basically, yeah. Damn. All right, um, the other thing, if you don't want to do that just yet, um, and I, I have a feeling you might be interested in this because it may piss off Doc if you do this. Um, his quote unquote um, girlfriend, Kim, was uh, kidnapped by a group of um, thugs or gang members, whatever you want to call them, in Alien Post Apocalypse, along with um, a few of her men, well, several of her men. And um, we'd, originally, we'd originally struck some kind of a trade deal with them where they would supply us with manpower, labor, basically, in return for just basic food and cigarettes, stuff like that. But they've all been kidnapped, so <clears throat> we may want to go and rescue them before they die or something. Oh, the kidnappers and... have been kidnapped. Sorry, what was that? The kidnappers have been kidnapped. No, the kidnappers kidnapped Kim, who is, quote-unquote, Doc's girlfriend. Mm -hmm. She yeah. has this child, I believe. She's at Amber, right? No, she's in Alien Post Apocalypse. Ah. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, not, not Mel. Not Mel. Yeah, right. not Mel. So that's another thing, and... Yeah, that's kind of the the main thing that's happened since I last was around. What about I, you? Anything? Anything new with you? No, I've been a blank slate for a while. <laughs> Fair enough. Yes. <clears throat> um. Also, um, I want to try. I have a sneaking suspicion that there's a lot more to Clem than meets the eye. So before we go do anything, I just want to pop over to the barbershop and then you can decide like, do we want to, do you want to go walk Patton? Do you want to go rescue Kim? Do you want to do something else? Oh, and um, do you know a Mr. Hunt? No somebody who you apparently dealt with um regarding the white dove originally yeah. no no okay well, well apparently mean, there's a 
Whoa. guy called Mr. White, uh, Mr. Hunt, <laughs> he wants to speak I, with, I, um, maybe I just, yeah, well, maybe, maybe Joshua knows him. I've, I've looked yeah. No worries. Yeah. <clears throat> Just let you know what's up. All right. How are um, you guys dressed currently? Um, 1950s, like, clothes. Full gold plate uniform, of course. Very well. Oh, and I have still my, um... <laughs> My long black dreadlocks with a long black beard on still. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah. Yes. Uh, if you do walk pattern, be sure to let me know what your gear you want to uh, try to walk it in. Yeah. 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 Maybe. All right. <laughs> Probably. A oh, good I'm going to play outdoors person mm. if I lose it. Um. Yeah. Yes, question. Um, I have a failure is sweet. <laughs> um, so would you like to take that and potentially try and keep it to the end of the adventure to pick your stat up? Because I don't need it. What does it do? Um, it means that you can basically f automatically fail your... Um, ah. Your roll. So as long as you, as long as you basically roll a seven on one of your stats, or or if you've got a really high level skill uh, that likes it like ninety eight or something, and you're like, okay. I'm never gonna fail that. You can that reminds me, fuck. He fails it. Yeah. yeah, it's a sexy card if you want to get. It's especially for stats. You got to roll that seven, but if you want to, if you get a seven or you want to roll a couple of pods, then that's like automatic stack up. Basically. Yeah. Um. Shit, I forgot. Uh, Logan, is it okay if I just... Uh, I'm not going to use any cards or anything. I forgot to roll my willpower thing last session. Is it okay if I just do it real quick? There's kill up. Yeah, of course. I won't use any cards or anything, obviously. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, Yep, okay. Oh, well, whatever. <clears throat> yeah, uh, okay, so yeah, sure. He's on a um, so I'd rather have you try and get a step up if you can. Yeah, because yeah. his stats are so fucking low. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, I, I feel sorry for fucking uh, uh, Rasslin Rad. He's sitting close to like human human minimum on most oh, of his stats. Oh, let me play you. Oh, hold on. Um, <laughs> yeah, give me you can have, I don't know. Just give me the crap. Sure, yeah. You can have this. This will come in handy, I promise. <laughs> All right. Yes, lovely. All right, so um, I want to go over to Clem's real quick. You guys uh head out of the the embassy. There's uh some some uh, housekeeper lady um who's like. Uh, she's a cat-headed lady, and she goes, "Excuse me." I I look at her. I get ready. I just she, get my hand ready. She puts, <laughs> <laughs> she puts her hands on her hips. <coughs> Don't either of you want any food before you go? Yeah. Yeah. Could be I nice. suppose. This way. She takes you guys in and feeds you a uh, makes and feeds you a good meal. Uh, she was like, "Oh yes, my name is Foxy. I'm running things while the elves are in uh, uh, Kinleyville." Nice to meet you, Foxy. Mm. Hello. Mm. Yeah. Um, are the elves back in Kinleyville? Yes. Mm. They're taking another vacation, are they? Yes. Uh, well, it's it, it's been quite a while since they've had one, and they do have now family and friends over there that they need to visit. <laughs> Crazy. Yes. <laughs> After a good meal, uh, she says, oh, yes. Um, are you going into town? Maybe. Why do you ask? I was wondering if you could take a uh, note uh, with you uh, to drop off 
at uh, 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 Keanu Beaver for me. Why don't you just get someone else to do it? She gives you the look. Oh I mean, we, we... she just gives you that glare that women can give that makes men go, I know I'm fucking up somehow. You're on the beaver. <laughs> <laughs> you came over with that. <laughs> Kinley is losing. All right, bye, bye. Bye. Okay, sure. I'm going to need a bit by. Hmm? Well, when you uh, need it by? Uh, now would be fine. And where is Keanu? Um, uh, yes, he, he is over uh, near the uh, uh, train station. Uh, he is one of the uh, the people who is helping uh, supervise the train station. <sighs> Thank you. Okay. All right, fine. <laughs> <laughs> All right, fine, fine. I'll drop off the note and then we're leaving. <laughs> fine, fine, she says. You guys are going out outside uh, and you notice the garage that you know that the spaceship's in that's under guard with rhinos. Over there is a very vivid red and uh, yellow tent. It's kind of like set up like Bedouin style tent, although they're using a lot more vivid colors than the Bedouin are known for. You're not sure why it's there. It's not being guarded. I think I know what's what it's for. They're no, we're not going in it. Mm-hmm. As Logan attempts to lure him into somewhere else. You're like avoid this, avoid that, avoid this. <laughs> All right, uh, I'll ask for directions. Where's the train station? Um, God. One of the rhino guards uh, gives you directions to it. It's it's not difficult to find. All right, we'll go there real quick and yeah. All right, so you guys are heading over there, and uh, uh, yeah, the the people are like, "Hello, Australians! Hello!" Hello. Completely. Hello. Yeah. You're pretty sure they're going to ask you stuff, Freddie. I uh, don't even look at them. Just. <laughs> Be aligned to the train station. Very, very rude to the uh, uh, various animal headed people that are greeting him in a most happy, fond manner. They seem friendly. Freddy stops his way over to the uh, uh, train station, and a beaver headed guy is there, and he is uh, currently talking to some other people. And he's like, uh, Yeah, we're going to have to get some help with that. I'm not even sure what to do. Did you let him run? <laughs> You just throw a letter to him and start running off. He's like, I, 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 I. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. All right. Both of you guys give me sprint rolls as you run away. He's like, wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> I get my, my back of my hand I'm ready for Bernie <laughs> Max slaps. <laughs> <laughs> Freddie's sprinting for all his work. <laughs> and you are too. You guys got to yeah, and I was like, damn, we could have used a couple of Australians. <laughs> uh, All right, two Clems. You guys run over to Clems. Uh, your penis <laughs> armor climbing away from that one. <laughs> Sprint everywhere. Just people sprinting after you. Lots, <laughs> lots. You're like, run. Oh, I'm my baby. <laughs> You guys uh, reach uh, uh, Clems, uh, otter-headed Clems in there, and he says, Abby, what can I do you for? So, Logan, the last time that I detected Tenton here and succeeded, uh, am I able to tell what is, like, Tenton, or is it, like, just a general area? Over there is oh. the closest you can get. Over there, okay, so, like, just the entire shop then, or like yeah. the corner of the shop? Okay. Yeah. Um, I want to try this. I'll probably fail, but whatever. I want to try analyze, what was it called? Analyze power pattern. Ooh. On 
and it has to be an object. I want to try the towels. The towels? Yeah. Whoop, 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 says Freddy. Nope. Okay, well. Oh, my God. All right. So. Some... <laughs> I'll try some other time. All right. Um... I'm trying to send to Trump just for the hell of it while he's doing it. Kimberly's going, whoop, whoop, whoop. You're becoming worried that people will eventually catch up. It shows like a bunch of animal headed people rushing toward the barber shop. <laughs> All right. Um, We've got things I, for uh, to do. Come on, let's get them. Let me take you to the new patent just so you have access to it. And then it's up to you if you want to do it or we can come back later. Okay. Yeah. Um, Hot towel in the shade, please, Clem. Howdy, what can I do you for? Hot towel in the shade. Where are you going back to? Lost John Saloon. Him as well? Yeah. All right. He goes over and puts the towel on Kinley. Gets the towel and goes, and puts I'm it on. Him like, oh. And uh, you guys are sitting there with hot towels on your head, and you hear dun, 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 dun. sounds like one of those uh, pianos with the paper deal that goes through them, like in uh, uh, Westworld. Dun, dun, dun. I pulled the towel off my face. I walk up and I pull Alex's off, as he's probably not used to this. And he's just sitting there waiting. You guys are uh, you're sitting at one of the tables. Uh, there seems to be a bottle of whiskey and uh, three glasses uh, at the table. Nice. You see Clem over there attending bar. That's kind of weird. What? Yeah, he's not a barber. Howdy. We what can I do you for? Says Clem. We don't know how to activate him yet. He brings over an additional bottle. Yes. Excellent. Martini, shaken, not stirred. He goes back, brings you a, a, a foul tasting martini. Fuck. Oh, that goes out. Yeah, okay. Uh, no, uh, shaken, shaken is uh, always a foul tasting martini. I yeah, I know. Can't do that because uh, I thought that might be the secret code or whatever, but no. Uh, no, no, you instead are stuck drinking this foul tasting martini. <laughs> All right, it well like then. It's a one-story thing that you're in, and the weird thing is, you know those uh, uh, swinging saloon doors and such, Matt? Mm -hmm. Yeah. They've got those, and outside, like, they don't protect against the cold at all, but in here, it's nice and normal warm and stuff, like, you know, wearing your t-shirt warm. Out there, it looks like Canada cold, mm -hmm. you know, and you can see the wall of fire close mm -hmm. by as well. Does he notice anything weird about it? Uh, yes. Uh, you notice that the wall of fire, uh, imagine it's now uh, like the, the waves of an ocean. It's kind of moving out and then coming back in. And sometimes some of the fire goes out and then restarts, kind of like a bad burner on a stove. So does that mean that the, the broken pattern in that wall is getting worse or, or does it being fixed? Are you asking him or me? I'm asking Freddy. Ah. Well, I wasn't able to really discern much, but um, hmm. Bargain Man or Tommy, as we, as he's actually called, was, and basically, um, yes, we believe that it's for some reason getting weaker. Hmm. I believe Doc may know more about that. But there's not much we can do about it. Yeah. Why do I feel that every session from now on I'm just going to be playing catch up? <laughs> there's so much going on. Yeah. Um, so yeah, we, we don't, if you ever do come here, make sure you have a trunk with you because we don't know how to use Clem. If you have any ideas, feel free to spout them out at him. But Anyway, the pattern uh, is over here. I'll walk over to the wall and... He goes over to the 
perfectly normal bare patch of wall. Hmm. Put my hand up to it. See you in a bit. Touch it. You disappear. You guys are both in a metal corridor. If you were to go that way, you see a wooden bridge with the horrible old man from scene 24 standing nearby cackling and rubbing his hands together. If you were to go the other direction, you see you see it goes into a big fucking room that has a pattern inscribed on the floor. You do not need to go over the bridge to get to the pattern. Yeah, if you're coming from the other direction, you kind of popped out like midpoint between the bridge and the pattern. Yeah, that's where they came from originally to get here. Um, they had to answer three questions or whatever, and if they failed, they die, but not die, die, just <clears throat> the other die. I hate that shit. Glad I definitely missed that bit. Uh, and also, if you look over there, just mm -hmm. on the other side of the bridge, there's some inactive robots. Actually, no idea what they do. It goes to a corner, so you can't see them from here. But around oh, okay. well, I'll, there, I'll show them to him. Yeah. yeah. Do you want to walk them over there? That mean crossing the bridge. Oh. oh well, then I'll just tell them this. Yeah. Well. <laughs> yeah. For some reason, Kinley doesn't want to cross the gorge of eternal death and the bridge of peril things and stuff. Uh, no. I want to go show him the <laughs> weird hand panel thing. Ah. Right here, here's what it looks like. Uh, hey, oh. ah, there's a picture of the saloon as well uh, for you. But demon box. Nice. And next to it is an empty uh, pillar thing. And there's the horrible old man, of course, from scene 24. It, what, next to what? The pillars next to what? The. The hand scanner thing. Well, the thing that he told you is a hand scanner. It's about the right height for being a hand scanner or possibly mashing your penis up against. So what's the, Put your hand on it, see what happens. What's the, uh, what's the pillar for? The hand scanner's in the pillar, I believe. Uh, no, it's next to it. Next to oh, it. Oh, next to it. Uh, yeah. No idea what the pillar's for. Pretty good in your shit. <laughs> <laughs> I stripped the fuck off. <laughs> what are you doing now? I didn't take it. I have, it doesn't I have to do it now. It's all right. I like it. <laughs> right, well, make sure you don't like it. put your hand on the scan first. It needs to scan you. I think. Okay. I put my hand on the scan. A beam of light appears and goes from left to right and back again. And, when, and then it makes like a little picture of your hand. And then words appear. It says, welcome, oh great Alex Kinley. <laughs> I like you, demon box. <laughs> it goes back to the blue and yellow uh, grid. Hmm. Excellent. Uh, uh, all right, well, if you want to do it, go right ahead. <laughs> With glistening backside and rippled muscle back. <laughs> He's <laughs> posing for you. <laughs> give me a give me a uh, um, uh, pose posing roll. This is something that professional weightlifters work on. I don't know if I actually have that. Surely I should have that by right now. Uh, if so not, you'll be getting it soon. Right. Let's have a let's have a learn. Come on, learn. <gasps> Close. <laughs> you get to watch his mighty rippled buttocks go. <laughs> You're not paid enough for this shit, you think, Freddy? I'm not paid at all for this shit. Oh, well, well, there you go then. Yeah, I want to see what this new thing is about. You can maybe get some information from this. Could that Alex don't die, please? I'll do my best. All right. I try and force my way through the pattern, the new pattern. A new pattern. Okay. You begin to step upon the pattern, and immediately the same kind of bluish sparks and such begin kicking up around your feet as you confidently tread forward, relying on your mightiness to get you through the day. And let's see. Walking pattern. There we go. What? Is your strength? 114. 
Right. Oh. Call it 115. Uh, hold on, I'm going to need my calculator for this shit. Not used to people having them quite that high and I'm a little dim. So we go to calculator function. Clear 115 equals 35. Right. You need to roll an 85 or less. <clears throat> he doesn't even slow down. He's just walking. And the worst thing is you can see that the sparks are getting up closer and closer to his cock and balls. And he's going, <laughs> <laughs> right. What is your endurance? My endurance 94. Call it 95. So it's 15. Roll a 65 or less. Uh, I have a support to re-roll, if I can give that to Freddy. You yeah. can. Yes. Cool. Oh, boy. Oh, Hold on, let me change it. Wait. Uh, yeah. I just it. I just it. There you go. Uh, okay. I don't play that. Ooh. Right. I don't know why I'm rolling. I, right. Still need 65, 65 or less after he plays the supporter reroll. Yes. Great. Now, what is your willpower times five? A hundred. Uh, let's see. So you need a 70 or less. 70 or less. You striding oh. forward. Oh, 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 oh. He stands in the middle of the pattern, waggling his penis at you and posing dramatically. Can I get another posing roll? Yes, yes, you can. <laughs> I want to get that skill now, big time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Everywhere I'm going to go, I'm just going to be like, let me just put my foot up on this chest here. So, tell me about this thing. <laughs> Damn you, posing roll. Are you wanting to walk it also, Freddy, or are you good? I want to see what happens with him first. All right. He looks very, very pleased. <laughs> you you all right, Alex? Of course I am. He flexes <laughs> at you. Shows his Do you penis. feel any different? <laughs> I tickly? My balls and cock and balls are very tickly at the moment. The sparks are nice. Mm. Now, uh, question, did you have any any uh, um, uh, weapons or, or whatever like, magical pocketed? Everything. everything. I was like, here's the hammer, and then I was like, here's the scythe. Shit! <laughs> the fucking scythe. Put that down. Got it, got it. You got, you got naked, naked. Um, got naked. It's probably a good idea. Uh, roll a d8 and add it to your sanity, unless you're already up I'm there. Maxed. Uh, you don't care about that, then. Um, let's see. Also, uh, hold on a second. There's something special about this fucking pattern. Um, oh, while you are in this pocket shadow thing, as the PCs have begun calling it, you have a permanent plus 10% luck modifier. Holy crap. Hmm. Okay, so make a note of that somewhere. In, so, in, so in only in this pocket shadow thing. If you leave the firewall, then that, that stays in the firewall. Right, okay. So but anytime you're in the firewall, permanent plus 10 for the total modifier. Holy shit. Okay. And on top of that, mm -hmm. hold on a second. Let's see here. Open. Amber powers. Okay, dealing with your pattern stuff only because this does not help Trump stuff. Uh, let's see. Where's the pattern? Okay, what pattern power are you up to? Uh, not a lot. Um, so I basically got uh, I start with Trump with Shadows and I want to sketch Trump and then send to Trump. So really travel three shadows is the um, Oh you don't have detect power pattern? No. Cool. Um now you have a choice uh, between picking up that one which advances you on the uh, up to the higher levels of Trump. Right. Or you could instead branch off to may attempt to travel through shadow the second time in the day, or you could go to uh, Royal Road, which uh, takes fucking five times as long to cross Shadow, but it's a comfortable going. Or you could go with 
Hell Ride, which takes a less time to cross shadow, but it gives sand loss and is bad and all that. Very dangerous. Ha. Huh. Ah, but if you want to increase your actual strength, detect power pattern is the yeah. going toward the uh, one where you'll eventually be able to create artifacts. Yeah, that probably seems like the one that's going to be a bit easier to try and get crit on to get to the next one anyway. I can just use that kind of once a day, yeah? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'll use that, please. There it is. Bing. That's the one Freddie was doing earlier. Yes. Now, I will say that the one above this leads to a lot of very interesting shit that oh, yeah. will make both of you very happy. Well, I have the next one, but yeah. Ah, well, would you agree it leads to a lot of interesting shit that will make him happy? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, there you go. Uh, unfortunately, it's a bitch to try the next one. <laughs> oh, yeah. Anyway. It's a it's a nice bottleneck. So that's that's uh, what you oh and you have no insanities on you. So yeah, that's that's pretty much your pattern experience. Um, yeah, sweet. Well, it's worth it just to get the extra power um, and the, well, the plus ten luck is fucking sweet as shit. Oh yeah, um, you're not sure why you got that, but you suspect both of you give me pattern lore rolls and stuff as you discuss I think, uh, i'm thinking can i just tell you what i'm thinking before you you totally that? can I'll, I'll give you it's dependable it's going to be different for each different person and it's giving me that because of kind of like who and what i am and what i i kind of i, I embody um so you know i'm kind of the whole luck of the irish irish you know leprechaun blah 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 so it's like plus 10 but someone else it could be something else that's what i'm thinking Okay. Um, I mean, why why you got the next more powerful pattern uh, right. skill? As in, oh yeah, right. Detect power pattern. But yeah, so I got my successful pattern. Did you? Yes. Um, dealing with uh, patterns in general, the luck thing is you're not sure what's up with that, but you suspect that whoever's controlling the thing set that up or something. But um, as far as the, what's it called? Uh, the gaining a more powerful uh, up in uh, the pattern skills, uh, you believe that it might be each new pattern you walk, like each unique pattern you walk, if it's a full pattern, not pattern fragments or some shit, you may end up getting a new skill thing for pattern. But... Oh, wow. Finding new patterns is obviously not. So there's two ways. You either walk through a new pattern to get another skill, or you crit the skill before it, basically. Yes. So do I get, because I've walked this now, do I get any more information about this specific pattern as far as um, how it differs to the first one I walked? Um, it, felt, it felt almost identical to you. Right. Uh, it, 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 it was kind of like... Uh, it's kind of like one of those those frozen pop things that you like uh, that was like a very similar flavor, but a little bit different. It's right. still a frozen uh, uh, sweet treat type thing. Okay. Um, what? Uh... Are you wanting to just stand naked in the middle of the pattern? And... Sure. Okay. Freddie, take a picture. <laughs> what? Uh, hold on. Okay. Can you, stand, can you stand there for an hour? Sure. <laughs> I pull up the stand. Not even any hesitation. Go ahead and give me a sketching roll as you spend an hour sketching him. You know what? I'll try and make a trump out of him as well. <laughs> what? You mean paint a trump? Because the sketch only good. lasts for a week. And yeah. burn I know, but then why not? Oh, okay. It's I failed it. Yeah, well. I don't it, know if I've already asked this, but can you can you make can you make a painting trump off of a sketch? So if you sketch something yet. for ten days, could you not then try and make a painting of that sketch? No. No. Uh, the, the one of the players has discovered uh, uh, some of the higher level powers allow them to do different shit that they has something to do with what you're saying. 
No, no, you're just crazy. Mm -hmm. All right, so now it pauses. Uh, okay. where, would you, where, where would you like to teleport to? So that, so that is that's the that's the um, pattern that the duck created using the, the red room. Gem of judgment, yeah. Right. So it was Doc then that put that particular aspect in there. I don't know if he made it or if Ghost Wheel added it in or don't right. know. So he used what? What is Ghost Wheel? <laughs> right. I believe Ghost Wheel is the entity that I think made this pocket shadow and the firewall, but I might be wrong. I, I, I'm pretty sure he made, or it made, or they made whatever Ghost Wheel is. They made the firewall. I'm not sure about the actual. So part of, shadow. part of ghost wheel is the ghost wheel is the scanner, right? It's something like that, yeah. Right. That's what Joshua told me. So before we leave, I would like to try and use my new skill to take power pattern specifically on that actual console. Do you I want to see. teleport over to it? That's the only way to get out teleporting. You don't want to. You can't walk the pattern backward, is what you've been told. Oh yeah, no. When I'm done, I'm, you you just choose, don't you? Like I'm sure last time I yeah. chose to be outside. Yeah, yeah. I teleport over to it. All right. Ah. <laughs> he jumps the scanner suddenly. It shrieks and scurries off. No, um, it's um, just saying. I want, I want to see if there's any elements of pattern within the actual. Whoop, whoop, he says, "Go for it." Oh my. <laughs> Oh, please. <laughs> That's the fucking luck of the Irish there. The duck. <laughs> wow. All right. Now, um, first off, a little bit. A little bit of pattern? Yeah. In the, in the machine? Yeah. Mm. Now, machine. from here, you have choices. You can either go for the next more powerful one up, which is lead a small group through shadow between four and ten people, which can lead to some very tasty things. Yeah. But... You need at least four people. So if it's you two, you're gonna have to find two poor bastards to well, drag right. with. Kind of <laughs> uh, or you could take analyze power pattern to give a vague idea of what it does. Or you could take detect power chaos, which does the over there thing. Or you could go for detect power pattern for the second time in a day. What what's the one that allows you to climb? Is that you said it's to go up is lead the small group through shadow. Yeah, that's that one. Yeah, that's a bitch to it up. Yeah, well, Alex, Alex is uh, I have become evil, so there you go. That's that's the next more powerful one up. Now, keep in mind, uh, <clears throat> at your current skill, okay, this this part may be a bit confusing, but let me go through it for both of you just to be sure we're on the same page. <clears throat> Let's say you you create your detect power pattern, take detect power pattern second time a day, crit that, get detect power pattern third time in a day, right? Then later you you crit detect power pattern second time in a day, it does nothing for you because you've already got detect pattern three times in a day and it doesn't have any other branches. So the only ones that does good for you to crit is the uh, ones that have branches off of them, yeah, even though it's the same name. So, so it works just. Yeah. Spell. If you quit the latest one of per day, don't you then get an extra one per day? Yes, if they if they have extra ones per day. A lot of them just say, like, for example, detect power pattern. Um uh well actually that one works different. Let's let's pick detect power uh chaos. Mm -hmm. Uh it goes to detect power twice a day, and then I wrote etc. So you can get up to detect power chaos ten times a day, and if you crit that, you get eleven times a day yeah, and so yeah. on. So just keep going. Yeah, your your only job is to keep track of what's the what's the ones on the tree that will actually give you something for critting. Because uh, some people are confused and they're thinking if if I've got it up to three times a day by crit the one time a day one, then that gives me four times a day. It does not. Yeah, no, no, you got you got you. We already talked about this. You've got to crit the latest one in order to get the next 
Yeah, I just you wanted to. The, you can't quit the first one once a day and then get another one. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Although where you're at right now, critting everything except the basic shadow walk will still has more shit for you. Yes. Yeah, so Actually, the, even the basic out. shadow walk still has more shit for you. So pretty much where you're at, anything in your yeah. pattern stuff that you crit gives more shit. Yeah. Mm. Possibly Alex as well, or Freddie as well. I'm not sure. Yeah. yeah. Well, um, I am tempted to walk it, but I'm so close to getting my first matrix power. Oh, yeah. I don't want to burn hero points before I it's, it's get it, so. I'll, I'll, yeah, I'll say, I'll say. I, I like how there's a fucking, it's like doing what this, you're doing what this. Yeah. yeah. I, know a, I know it's a once a day power, so it's the next one up, but I'm, I, I'm so glad I went from reverse dice. I can't tell you how fucking good that is. So hopefully next yeah. time you get Well, I'm, I'm, I'm like two or three sessions away. Yeah. So. Yes. Yeah. Uh, do you want to hear something really fucked up? Yeah. For mm -hmm. unknown reasons to you, Doc Fulton has two reverse dices a day. Goddamn. Yeah. Yeah, he got very wow. fucking lucky. All right. Well, um, I'm glad you lived. Mm -hmm. Good job. You would be even more glad if he was to put on some motherfucking clothes. <laughs> he poses in front. Of, oh, when you're standing in front of the uh, scanner? Uh, you know, in the Facebook thing, when you type the word congratulations, if you were to click on it, it makes like little oh, yeah. sparkles. It does that. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Wow. Thank you, demon box. Right, I'll get all my shit back together. Done. Uh, give me uh, the pocket roll for the yeah. sites so you don't have to carry that fucker around. Uh, yeah. Is that the ice site? Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, I'll need to delete that from storage then. Stole it off the uh, Sheila. <laughs> well, no, no, there's still one in the storage. Oh, there's still one. Okay, fine. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm going to play training time. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's okay. Mm -hmm. That's a good idea. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna... Pocket scythe. God yes. damn, he rolls well. Wow. That's almost a fucking crit. I oh, know. So close. Mm -hmm. So close. I'm not worried about that though, because I don't know what else I'd want to get pocket wise. Nunchucks! <laughs> Alex can leave with nunchucks. That's all we need. Scary shit. Mm -hmm. Ah, we've added the ads button to the. That's cool. Freddy's yeah. been working his butt off on yeah. that shit. The weapon combats. It's nice to have because I'm going to move some of my abilities up. Now, if you add more to these pages, it's, just, it's going to make the page longer, isn't it, um, Alex? Yeah. Yeah, okay, cool. I'm gonna hit the restroom real quick while you guys discuss what to do. Yes, well, come dried humps the, <laughs> uh, the passing submission. Good start. <laughs> and it was a good start. You made it look easy. Yeah, lucky. Got the hiding stats. Right, oh my god. Uh, so right, so um, you were talking about trying to go and save. Oh. Yeah, I mean, you like rescue missions, right? Yeah, sure. So, and we'll probably also need to kill the leader, Buckethead. So that'll be fun. Yes, I know where you're Um, One small caveat. No magic in post-apocalypse. At all. No rolls, no nothing. Wow. Yeah. That sucks. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But tech works, at least. Mm. Oh, also, I have access to Cyberpunk again. Uh, Hong Kong, specifically. If you ever need to go there, I have a Trump of the area. No money, unfortunately, but we can go there. Mm. And um, Shermer, Illinois, as well. 2001 Earth. Just letting you know if you want to go there. So, um, 
Raslin, the person who kind of started the whole trade negotiations with Kim and her people, he came up with an interesting idea on how we could potentially rescue them. So his idea, and again, this is just his idea, is to deliver a large, basically, shipment, well, not really a shipment, but deliver them like a bunch of alcohol, get them all drunk, sneak in during the night, and then free Kim's people, weaponize them, and kill everyone. That was his idea. The old get them drunk and go in while they're asleep ploy. Yeah. Yeah. I, like I, I mean, they're like, they're not very bright, so to speak. They're like scruffy individuals. They wear, they have like makeshift armor. Their weapons are kind of meh. But they still have weapons, obviously. But they're not like military soldiers or anything. They're just goons. Mm -hmm. Well, Buckethead is probably a bit more than that, but yeah. So, um, the only thing is, um, he gave some vague directions on how to get there. We need to go through the sewers, go west-ish, he described it all, I'll have a look in a sec, and then we'll go up to basically like a, a shoreline, and then their base is just down the shore, kind of follow the shore and we'll find their base. Okay. Yeah. So that's, um, yeah. let me actually have a look real quick what the <laughs> directions were specifically. So I don't fuck this up. Holy shit, Matt. You should have worn your Gila suit today. Tonight? No, today. Oh, today. Yeah. Unless it Oh, I meant for the session. Anyway, yeah. in, in the future, you can wear it while you're gaming. Yeah. Anyway, what did you wild men decide to do? Oh, well, we're going to go on the rescue mission, I think. I think. What? A rescue mission. I think. Oh, really? Maybe, yeah, but we need to, like, figure out how to do it specifically. Um, well, yeah, the only bad thing about this place that you're in is there are no chairs. Maybe the old man will let you sit on the bridge. Oh, right, yeah, let's, let's go back to... Um, <laughs> uh, let's go back to the embassy. I'll trump us over there. All right, no problem. Two minutes later, you arrive back at the embassy. Okay. Um, Shows a rope, hmm. bands of uh, furry people looking for you guys. Uh, missions, missions, missions. Okay. Time for the embassy. <laughs> or are you? <laughs> oh, I found the directions. They're not particularly useful, but okay. <laughs> Um, so anyway, do you have any ideas how to do this, Alex? I, I know you're skilled in combat, but there's more than, like, one person. Yes. Yes, so. and Julie. Yeah. Yes, um, yeah, mm, mm, mm. without knowing a bit, I need to kind of see What's yeah, do you want to go scout them out first and have a look? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 